Okay folks, this is going to be an overview of the Canon T3i, uh, basic DSLR. They've come out with newer models since then, the T5i, T6i, and they have a few more bells and whistles, but essentially it's about the same that it's been over the course of the years. So our package comes, it's very simple, it's going to come with a soft case, camera body, 18-135mm uh, to 135 millimeter lens, two batteries, battery charger, and then a circular polarizer in case you're working exteriors does not come with an SD card, that is mine, and that will be something that you'll have to supply yourself for use with this camera. Okay, so um, it does come this way, it comes with the, the lens separated from the camera body. So what we're going to do is, that's going to be the first thing we do, is go ahead and attach that. There's a little lens release button here on the side, near the, the Rebel logo. And so we're going to remove this body cap here by pushing that in and then rotating counterclockwise. You'll see the image sensor there. Please don't expose that image sensor to bright, bright sunlight. It will damage it. And then don't leave this out like this because dust can get in here. And you can see those image sensors are pretty dirty because these things have been used for quite a few years. So on the lens, I noticed I removed the rear cap of the lens so that I can attach the lens here. There's a white marker on the lens, and there's also a corresponding white marker on the lens mount. And so I'm going to try to visually match those up. And then once I have them attached and see the metal is flush, I'm not done yet, I'm going to rotate the camera, or rotate the lens um, clockwise until I hear a click. Okay, good. And then to release it, it's just the, the inverse. I'm going to press that button, rotate counterclockwise, and then pull the lens away from the, the body. Again, match those markers up, rotate, and you want to be careful mounting that lens. You don't want to sit there and fish around and try to find the connection because there's a lot of little metal flanges and stuff in there that could be bent or damaged. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to add the battery. So this little battery compartment down here, a little release. You can only put the battery in one way. Um, if you put it, try to put it in the wrong way, it just won't push in. So put that in like that. Spring loaded. Little catch. Close that up. Easy as pie. Next, the SD card slot, that opens up. You see we're going to insert our SD cards. If you're facing the rear of the camera, the label is toward you. Push that in. It is spring-loaded, so you want to make sure you push it in all the way. And then close that compartment. Open it up by pressing that way. Open, push in on it. Pops out, pull out. Okay. And that baby is ready to shoot, pretty much, um, in a very, very basic, basic sense.